We go to Vernon Township High School for this NJAC clash, and Wilkins Valley takes a 1-0 lead here, watching Lexus Mendes feed Brielle Hilbert, who launches the long-distance blast for the goal. And with 15.07 left in the first half, Wilkins has the 1-0 lead. What a shot. Vernon looks to knock things up here, watch Victoria Gonzalez with a nice play before her rocket goes just wide and Walk Hill Valley maintains the 1-0 lead. The Vikings get another great chance here off the Taron Schofield throw-in. The ball bounces around before Walk Hill Valley keeper Katie Bertoa makes the save on Simone Marchesian and Walk Hill Valley has a 1-0 lead at the half. Second half we go and Vernon has a corner kick and watch Jillian Pullis with the service as Bertoa punches it out. The ball is loose but Walk Hill Valley is whistled for the foul in the box and Vernon gets a PK. And on the penalty kick, watch Jillian Pullis go to the upper 90 for the goal, and we are tied 10 minutes into the second half at 1. Walkill Valley tries to snap the tie here. It's Anna La Calamita. She gives a nice touch to Brielle Hilbert, but Vernon keeper Shannon Turner makes the save for the Vikings. But the Rangers score here off the nice service on the corner by Brittany Todd. It's Brielle Hilbert with the one-timer, and Walkill Valley has a 2-1 lead with just under 14 minutes left in the second half. Vernon's working hard to get that equalizer, but once again, Katie Berto is there for Walk Hill Valley and the save as the Rangers would hold off Vernon 2-1. to one. We played really hard, and we gave up a little bit, but that goal should have never happened. I'm so thankful my defender was there because it would have gone in regardless. But I played with her, and she is a really good player, and I'm so glad we shut her down. She has so much good, so many good moves. The whole team did good from the back to the forward. We did good passing, and we, it was good to finish off the corner kicks, and it was a great job overall for everyone. It felt great. We uh, played with our hearts out, and we just did good passing and good finishing. It felt really good. We were like pumped to get started at this game, and we just kept at it, and we all worked together, and we gave it our all, and it felt really good to win. Wokill Valley beat Delaware Valley. 2-1 to one in the Hunter Warren Sussex tournament, giving them a tremendous amount of confidence as they will play Warren Hills. And this team only has three seniors, so they're ready to go. Beat in Del Val, and they are a really big school with many players that could like try it out. And we played like the best of them. It gives us so much confidence to play in the next round against Warren Hills. And they're a seed above us, so that's going to make us push... 10 times harder and make us want to win 10 times more. Playing with our hearts out and we're going all in and we're just going for the win. <laughs> Gives us great confidence. You know, being Del Val was a big win and we all worked together hard to get that win. It always gives us motivation when we win and it gets us all pumped for the next game. So 